Hello and welcome to episode 20 of the Estate Planning Academy. I'm your host, Gary DeWitt, and this is the Internet's most passionate show about estate planning. Today's episode is ways to give money to your spouse. Married couples have an advantage under IRS law. They get unlimited gifting to each other without gift tax. The same advantage does not apply to cohabitating couples. Instead of making all accounts joint accounts, you can create beneficiary designations and payable on death designations. Make your spouse the beneficiary of your life insurance. Make your spouse the beneficiary of your retirement accounts like IRAs, 401ks, 403bs, etc. Make sure your spouse is a joint tenant with right of survivorship on your real estate or create beneficiary deeds. You may have to create new deeds. A trust can be used to hold real estate for your spouse's benefit while passing it to your children only. These are especially good in blended family situations. Make sure your spouse can access any safety deposit boxes only in your name. Make sure your spouse knows where everything is located. Nothing is worse than relying on statements in the mail to find things. Create a trust to make sure any personal items such as high-priced jewelry and other valuable assets transfer to your spouse free and clear of probate. A trust can be used to hold real estate for your spouse's benefit while passing it to your children only. These are especially good in blended families.